My name's David Doling. I've been in the industry for 10 years and I've been with Traffic Jams Motorsports before. My biggest challenge that I've faced in the last year has been coming back into this industry after being gone for so long. I've seen a lot of new procedures, uh, new processes, and I'm glad to see where the industry has come since then. And I'm glad to be a part of it again. I enjoy this and it, you know, it's great to see the joy that it still brings the customers, that they still love this. My coworkers and customers would say that I'm a very focused person, that whatever problem or issue may arise, that I will do whatever it takes to find a solution whether that's reaching out to people in our field or going online to Educar, uh, other sources to find information. And that they can always count on me to be there, whether it's you know staying late to make sure we get jobs done or to always be there for the customer. My installation specialty is the day-to-day -day items. Radios, amplifiers, amp racks, wiring up vehicles. Um, my philosophy is to treat every vehicle as like it's special, because to each customer it is. Whether they're putting in a radio or a $30,000 system. You know, I want to make sure that we treat it just like they would treat it and that we understand how important it is to them just to have a radio on. What I want customers to remember most about my installations is the attention to detail. You know, not to overlook anything to make sure that what we can do is done. That they have the USB where they want it, where they have the base knob where they want it, you know. And even if they don't ask for it, to go above and beyond to make sure that they get, you know, excited about what they, you know, had installed. Some of the people in this industry that have influenced me and what I do and I have to be, obviously, Jamil Whitty. You know, he has taught me a lot as far as, you know, what it takes to be in this industry, not just from an installer point of view, but from sales, from owner aspect. You know, other people would have to be Ben Freeman. I've known him for almost 10 years now. He has taught me a lot about installing, about learning. Um, I think another person would definitely have to be Biscuit, AKA Michael Biscoff. Um, he has been here since I came back to Traffic Jams and he has taught me a lot. He helped me come back into this industry and learn a lot of the new things that we have. He has been there, you know, during business hours and after business hours. And he's taught me a lot. I believe I should be considered for the top 50 installers because of my passion for this field. You now, I left it, but like any good thing, it pulled me back in. I have a passion for this industry and what it stands for. I love to see where it's going the new things that we're able to do with it. I've been learning 3D printing, 3D modeling, trying to find new ways to do what we do, faster ways, better ways. I love this industry, I love what I do, and I'd love to be considered for top 50. So this is my workstation. I have my roll cart, which goes with me to any vehicle, don't have to take 
the big toolbox. I also have my bag, go inside boats, go everywhere I need without having to walk back and forth. Efficiency. Uh, I also have my setup for the 3D printer that we use. Uh, currently, right now, I am working on a tweeter pod for a BMW, as you can see right here. I also have this in the background here. This is going in a uh, project vehicle that we're working on. Stay tuned for that. Um, as far as keeping things organized, you know, wires, anything with a handle, anything for bits, drill bits, anything that needs to be screwed in or uh, nailed in. Um, so that's my work area. Nothing too fancy, but it gets the job done.